go to Portugal. I tried to buy us a first class ticket. Well, that was an adventure. Excuse me, ma'am. Oh my god! I have some sardines. Where do we go from? Where do we go from here? We've just loved our time in Madrid. Now it's time to go to Portugal. We're leaving really early for the train. Won't be light for another couple hours. Another awesome thing about Madrid, it stays lit up like this all night long in the downtown area. Something to know when you're traveling on the trains in Spain is if you buy a long distance ticket, the short distance ticket, like from the hotel to the main station, is included in the price. It'll give you a little code on the top of the ticket, scan that right on the gate, lets us right in. So it saved us, I don't know, five, 10 bucks. Train start running at 6 a.m. Now we'll catch our train to Vigo and then tomorrow we'll head to Portugal. Train system is super easy to use. That's our train right there. We just wait till it gets closer. We'll tell us what platform to go to. We're getting on the train and now I'm trying to find car seven. I tried to buy us a first class ticket. I saw this was a first class train and I mistakenly bought us a second class ticket on a first class train. But seats are comfortable, so I inadvertently saved just a couple bucks. Plugs under the seat, this little tray table. And footrests. We said to move seats. A lot of other people are too. The number on the outside of the train is not correct. It's the number on the inside on the little screen. That one's the correct. Vigo, Spain, we got a hotel right across the street from the train station so we could just go up and relax. We got this place for $60 a night. That's one massive bathroom. But look at this view. It is spectacular. And that's the train station right there, right across the street. We didn't come out of the exit right there, we actually walked all the way over there and up the hill and around. But you know, I guess we needed some extra exercise. For the last five days, we've been sleeping in twin beds. So it's nice to actually be able to sleep together. <laughs> and let's see. Oh, that's not a pillow top, but it feels comfortable. If we seem a little bit less than energetic, it's because neither of us really slept at all last night. Train trip was beautiful. We didn't show much because most of it was fogged in. All right, let me tell you a little bit about the train ride from Madrid up to, what's the name of Vigo. Vigo. <laughs> oh, I can remember that. He's cute. Well, let's just picture this. Slice the trench all the way from there to here. Then you put that train in the trench. So 75% of this train ride was either the walls of the trench or the tunnel. It was a nice, comfortable trip. There wasn't much to see except for little bits and pieces that you looked really fast. We got some little patches getting to see the beautiful countryside of Spain. But it was still really nice. I would prefer to come this way than by bus or by plane. Did they slowed down going through the mountains, but we were going over 150 miles an hour. Yeah, it didn't feel like it. Super smooth. I didn't get sick, so that was a plus. But I had my trusty thing on the whole way. I'm gonna go take a nap. Wow. One more look at that gorgeous view. And look at that view is about all we did last night because it was raining. Well, we did do one more thing. We walked across the street to the mall to grab some dinner. Yes, we can't resist. We're going to Taco Bell in Spain. We have to catch a bus in an hour. Well, it's supposedly a 20 minute walk. We'll see. <laughs> adventure. We walked to the bus station. Right now we're just waiting for our bus to get here. They only sell their tickets for also buses online, so there's not really anybody here to help. It feels a little weird, but we've gotten verification from two bus drivers that our bus picks up right here. So if all goes well, we'll be on the bus in a few. If not, we'll have a new video of us showing you a new adventure. It's here. Just like ADO. <laughs> Welcome to Portugal. Yay! I believe this is Kate's 40th country. 
Oh, I think it is. I think it might be our 39th country together. I'll have to check tonight. Great bus ride. And this, thankfully, this girl on there said, we should probably get on the second stop. It's a probably about a 10 minute walk instead of a half hour walk. That's Laura from Canada. Hi. She gave us directions. Nice hey. meeting you guys. She just walked the Camino. I just walked the Camino Portuguese uh, from Porto to Santiago. It took 10 days. It was the best and it was the worst. It's great to meet you. Have a good, good trip. Good to meet you. Bye. So we're just going to get to our Selena, to our hostel, get checked in. And uh, we'll talk more after that when we don't have the bags and such. Be nice. It's beautiful here. Wow. Awesome. For our time in Porto, we have decided to stay at a Selena Coblib. We'll show you the rest of the facilities and tell you where the Coblib is later. But for now, we're just going to show you our awesome room, which as you can see, has a lot of seating options. A giant comfortable bed, great work desk for Chris, and windows that open that have a view of the courtyard. A huge fridge, and for some reason, a record player. And it's a giant bathroom. It smells a little bit, but I'm gonna blame it on the drain. Once we use it a couple times, I think it'll go away. Lots of space. Shampoo, conditioner, and sparkly foaming body gel. Now it's time to unpack and relax because we're gonna be here for the next two weeks. We're trying to find this place for lunch and I can't seem to find it. I'm gonna go ask this lady. It's a Rosie! <laughs> I love you guys. That wasn't staged, so <laughs> shut up. <laughs> what have you been doing for the last month of your life? Uh, I walked the Camino de Santiago from Porto to uh, Santiago de Compostela, Spain, 170-ish miles. You're a rock And then star. eating a lot of pastel donato. That's it. Pastel donato. Oh, you don't know about this. I don't. Do you know about Pastel Donato? I do not, but we have an expert, so we're gonna find out. I am the expert. <laughs> but we really are looking for lunch, so peace. Well, I picked this is the restaurant. We're Look hungry. Like we don't know what, what it's gonna be like, but we're gonna try this one. These are like fish empanadas that they brought us. Those are really good. I don't know if they have a, um, a creamy taste to them. Mm. They're not fishy at all. I have a pork steak. Very moist, light batter on top. Excellent. And these are beans and rice. Oh, that's beans rice, but it's spicy red sauce. That's really good. I have sardines. Try sardines. Mmm, those are really good. They're not like you expect really salty sardines. They have just enough salt. Those are good. Also have a cheese omelet, which probably doesn't need much explanation because it's got potato chips on it, and that's amazing. Oh, what did you get, Miss Rosalie? I'm gonna go out and uh, surprise you by saying the lesbian got the sausage. <laughs> <laughs> Garlic sausage. And uh, it has a fried egg on top and some rice. And an olive. Give it a bite, see how it is. Crunchy on the outside. That's lovely. Yeah, this place is a winner. Yeah. Good job, Kate. Yet again. Thank you. That lunch was wonderful. What are you two cooking up? Rosie is about to show me her favorite dessert. Well, I don't know. It arguably, it could be a meal in itself, breakfast, um, dessert, maybe an afternoon snack. Maybe all three. Yeah, I'm about to find out. <laughs> I'm trying this custard filled something. <laughs> Apparently, Rosie like said there's the bag. These are really good. They're um, a puff pastry with sweet vanilla custard. Thank you. Well, we were walking along and stumbled across this gym. The world of cereal. Breakfast, lunch, or dinner. Rosie put the box back. <laughs> You cannot steal the cereal. Fruit Loops. I'm not a Lucky Charms person. I'm a Fruit Loops person. That's true. When I was little, my dad 
I would eat Fruit Loops all the time. My dad would be like, you're gonna turn into a Fruit Loop. Well. <laughs> <laughs> <Dad>. <laughs> Drinking his coffee. <laughs> Leave the, the thumbs, thumbs up, up and subscribe. subscribe. No, no, that was good. That was good. That was good. <laughs>